record. So beta square by how much? Three gamma. So to take the LCM, what you can write? Three gamma, three alpha gamma minus two beta square plus beta square. So what is the minimum current? Three alpha gamma minus beta square by three gamma. What is the value answer? Okay, so separate terms you have to write. So means three alpha gamma by three gamma minus beta square by three gamma. Three, three gamma gamma cancels out. So alpha minus beta square by three gamma is your answer. So it's your right option, tell me. C is the right answer. Understood everyone? Very simple problem, but that uh, minimum condition you have to remember. Try this, everyone. Sir, one is to three. Option C, sir. One is to three, sir. Three. Sir, one is to three. Who is this? One voice I recognize. Swedish. Next voice. Another voice. Jones, sir. Jones. Okay. Ratio of thermal energy released in two the resistors. Dinesha. Yes, sir. 
ratio of thermal energy released in two resistors r and p are connected in parallel in an electric circuit how much ah uh, last option sir name ma karani sir karani okay this is r and this is 3r they connected in the parallel combination right connected to the battery of voltage how much capital v how much heat energy developed in the first resistor tell me q1 equal to how much v square by r1 into t what a heat energy developed in the second resistor v square by r2 into t is my point clear all of you sir fourth option sir who is this rishi sir rishi so i want ratio so divided is each other v square t v square t cancels out so r2 by r1 r2 value how much 3r by r rr cancels out so 3 is to 1 is your answer option d is the right answer for the question is it clear all of you should not take uh, i square rt formula understood when they are series combination only should take that clear understood yes sir yes sir try this option option okay. who is this asus option d sir who is this ashin sir option d who is this harry samus harry shelton it na told the it sir Well, that well, that. Tell your name once again. Harry Samad sir. Oh, Harry Samad. Sir, one twenty-five sir. Who is this, John sir? Who is this? Sir, last up, John sir. Jones. Okay. All are, I think, Jones. Last option only. Now it is Dinesh. my turn. Ah, uh, who is this? Dinesh. Dinesh. Only these guys only telling. Remaining not telling. For uh, two seconds, everyone turn on camera. Jazreel, turn on the camera. Jazreel.
ओके सो इट इज माय टर्न A resistance of a wire is how much? Five ohm. Its new resistance in ohm is stretched to five times of the original length. Actually, you have to remember if something is stretched, R is proportional to what here? L square. You know resistance formula how much? Rho L by area. L is the length and A equal to area. But if you stretch the wire, volume remains same only, na? Multiply with length and divided with length. So R equal to how much? Rho L square by volume. The resistivity constant, volume constant. So resistance is proportional to length square. We should take the relation. Now I can write R one by R two equal to how much? L one square by L two square. What initial resistance? Phi by final resistance is R two. L1 is L square by R. L2 value how much? Phi into L whole square. So phi by R2 equal to how much? L square by 25 into L square. L square L square cancels out. R2 equal to how much? Phi into 25. Phi 25 are how much? 125 ohm. Option D is the right answer. Everybody very good job. Try this. The last option, sir. Who is this? Dinesh.
given uniform metal wire carries how much current 2 ampere and voltage drop how much 3.4 volt battery connected across it the mass of uniform metal wire is given something 8.92 into 10 power minus 3 kg and density how much 8.92 into 10 power 3 kg by meter cube and uh, Resistivity also 1.7 into 10 power minus 8 ohm into meter. The last option. Length is how much? Who is this? Abhishek. Old or new? Old. What is the Ohm's law formula? V equal to I into R. V is given 3.4. I is given 2. Resistance value. Rho L by area. So ones are to one point seven. So one point seven equal to resistivity is given how much? Substitute one point seven into ten power minus eight and into length by area. This is only our task. But area indirectly given. Density equal to how much? Mass by volume. Density. This is D is the density. D equal to mass by volume means what? Area into length. Area and uh, uh, this uh, density I will swap. Area equal to mass by density into length. Substitute here. Here 1.7, 1.7 cancels out. So 1 into 10 power minus 8 into L value how much? L only. Area value how much? M by D into L. I mean 1 into 10 power minus 8. L into L how much? L square and density how much? 8.92 into 10 power 3. Hold it by mass. Mass also given. 8.92 into 10 power minus 3. 8.92, 8.92 cancels out. L square equal to how much? 10 power minus 3 divided by 10 power minus 8 into 10 power 3. L square equal to how much? 10 power minus 3 by 10 power minus 5. L square equal to how much? 10 power 5 minus 3. L square equal to 10 power 2. L equal to root 100. Root 100 means what? 10 is our answer. Very good job, Dinesh, Tarani, and uh, Vishay. Old Vishay. Okay. Everyone understood? Purincha. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Try this.
सर नाइंटी वोल्ट सर ऑप्शन बी दिनेश जोन्स जोन्स ओके शॉप्स एंड सी सर अभिषेक सर Okay, so the question is saying the cell of EMF how much? Ninety volt connected across the series combination of two resistors. One is R one equal to hundred ohm, and R two also equal to hundred ohm. The voltmeter of resistance, resistance of voltmeter is four hundred ohm. Is used to measure the potential difference across the each resistor. The reading of the voltmeter will be how much? Means we have to draw the situation. So EMF equal to how much here? Ninety volt. The series combination. There are all all R two R in series. Okay. Sorry. R1 and R2 in series, 100 ohm and 100 ohm. 100 plus 100, how much? Let's count. 100 plus 100, how much? 200. 200. What is the resistance of this voltmeter? 400. 400. Then directly, this is 90 volt means, so I can write this junction 80, this junction 0, no? This is also 0. This is also how much? 80. This is 80. Sorry. So the visibility is 90, no? Correct or wrong? Junction is 90 minus 0, 90. Here also 90, here also 90. It was asking what the voltage drop across the resistor. Sorry, friend. Here he is asking, just now I realized he is measuring potential difference across each resistor. Okay. Understood. Means potential difference across the net resistance how much? 90 volt as well, as I told. Correct or wrong? What he was asking? Each resistor means this 100 ohm. This is what here? 100 ohm. And this is one voltmeter. That is 400 ohm. This is 90 volt. Are understanding uh, here 90, here also 90, and here 0, here also 0, here 90, here 0. I will assume here this is x. Now, a uh, voltmeter should not keep here. Where you have to keep any one of the rest, say yes or no. I will keep like this. This is 400 ohm. In this case, what is the reading of the voltmeter he was asking?
you find the junction x voltage that is game over na say sir no what is junction la tell me some of the currents going out of the junction zero only na say sir no so x minus 0 by 100 plus x minus 90 by 400 and plus x minus 90 by 100 equal to 0 understood all of you say yes or no yes sir sure. so if you take the lcm 400 4 into x plus x minus 90 plus 4 into x minus 90 equal to 0 take this lcm that side so 4x plus x minus 90 Plus four x minus three sixty. Four x plus x five x five x plus four x nine x minus ninety minus three sixty. How much? Four fifty. Four fifty actually. Nine x equal to four fifty. X equal to how much? Four fifty by nine. Nine ones are nine fives are nine zeros are. So x equal to how much? Fifty. Successfully we found. Now tell me what the voltage drop measured by the voltmeter? Ninety minus fifty only, na? Only say yes or no. Yes. So forty is the answer. So option A is the correct answer. Okay, it's a mind-bending question. Good question. Sir, try this. ऑप्शन ए सर ऑप्शन ए सर Jones and uh, Jones and Willis, the nationals. The Rishi sir. The Rishi also. The two metal wires of iron. Ah. Uh. I also choose the first option. Prima. Yes. 
okay two metal wires of identical dimensions are connected in series identical dimension means what l1 equal to lengths are same and area of cross sections also same but materials are different so sigma 1 is the conductivity of the first material sigma 2 is the conductivity of the second material the effective conductivity how much is asked is the two resistors are connected in which combination series combination so net rest in how much r1 plus r2 resistance value resistivity by effective length and effective area of cross section r1 value how much rho1 into l1 by a1 plus rho2 into l2 by a2 the lengths are same na what is effective length tell me l plus l how much 2l by area of cross section how much same only capital a rho1 value rho1 l1 value l by a plus rho2 into l by a area area length 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 cancels out 2 rho equal to how much rho1 plus rho2 resistivity value how much something by conductivity and 1 by sigma 1 plus 1 by sigma 2 by sigma equal to what is the lcm sigma 1 into sigma 2 sigma 1 plus sigma 2 So if you do invert under sigma by two equal to how much sigma one sigma two divided by sigma one plus sigma two. So you take that side. So what is the effective conductivity? Two sigma one sigma two divided by sigma one plus sigma two. Which is the right option? B is the right answer. Understood? Sir, effective area means two A only, no sir. No, sir. Capital A, only A. This is one resistor wire. Another resistor wire also like this, na. No? So the effective area will be like this one. Effective area will not change. Only effective length become two L. If you put two resistors in parallel, na. No? That are wrong. The effective Length remains same, but area remains as you told two A. Understood? Understood? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, the moral of this problem: you should do mistakes, students, and uh, should correct them. Clear? That is the practice purpose of practice. Okay. Should not feel shame or discouraging if you commit any mistake. Like this, if you practice where you are doing mistake, you will understand. Okay. No one is perfect in this world, but we should try to be perfect. Clear? Try this. Sir, third option. Third option. Third option, sir. This is good. So, a wire of resistance. What here? R one is drawn out so that its length increased by how much? 
twice of its original length. Initial length L1 means final length how much? L plus twice of its length means what final length will become 3L. So it is stretched only now. Stretched mean resistance formula L square only now. Say yes or no. If any wire is stretched R is not proportional to L, L square only now. Earlier also we did. So R1 by R2 equal to how much? L1 square by L2 square. R1 value R1, R2 value should find. L1 value how much? L square by L2 value. 3L whole square. L square, L square cancels out. So R1 by R2 equal to how much? 1 by 9. So R2 equal to how much? Tell me. Is asking R2 by R1. So do invert trend out. So 9 by 1 means 9 is to 1 is your answer. Option A is the right answer. Purin Jha. Yes. Sir, can you explain the question one more time, sir? Who is this? Abhishek, sir. A wire of rest in R1 is drawn out. Drawn out means what? Stretched out. Something is stretched out means what? Resistance formula rho into L by area. Volume remains same now. Length I will divide. I will multiply. Length I will divide. So rest in how much? Rho L square by volume. Resistance is proportional to L square. Understood. So R1 by R2 equal to L1 square by L2 square. Initial length is given L. Final length increased by 2L. No? So new length how much? L plus 2L, 3L. Substitute here, you will get the answer. Students, for 12th children, today 6.30 class is there. 6.30 to 8. Okay. Thank you. Tomorrow we will meet.